Good morning, everyone. Welcome to day seven of our cruise on the Carnival Mardi Gras. We're here in the Caribbean. It's a fun day at sea for us. We're just gonna check out more of the ship and get any of those last sights in that we didn't get to see already. But first, we're gonna go have breakfast at Shaq's Big Chicken. We haven't had their breakfast before, so I'm excited to try it out. Let's go. Adam had the chicken sandwich that had syrup drizzled over it and then I had the regular breakfast sandwich with egg, sausage, and cheese and biscuit. After breakfast we walked around on the sky deck to see if there was anything else we wanted to do. They have a basketball court but we weren't interested in playing basketball. We thought about playing a game of mini golf but there were a lot of people waiting to play so we decided against it. Since it is a day at sea, there were a lot of people playing on the water slide, so we decided against that as well. We found a place to play cornhole, so we decided to do that, which was pretty fun. We were just playing for fun, not keeping score, really. Next we went and did some shopping. I wanted to see if there was anything I couldn't live without, but I didn't end up finding anything. There's all kinds of stuff that I saw that I liked, but I just don't have room in my bag for it, or really the need for it in the first place. For lunch we went to Chi Bang. This restaurant is available for lunch and dinner. For lunch you just pick out what you want and then they bring it to your table. We started with some chips, pico, and salsa. Adam got ramen because you can choose to have your noodles in broth or not and then I decided to get a stir fry with shrimp and peanuts and some veggies too. Dessert, we each got this churro with a side of ice cream. It was really good. After lunch, we went to the casino, and of course I had to play my favorite game. And I wasn't doing too bad, I got a little bonus here. After the casino, we decided to head on over to the Alchemy Bar to get a drink. I wasn't necessarily in the mood for alcohol, so I asked the bartender to make me something that was non-alcoholic, and I just kind of left it up to her to decide what she wanted to make. She made this fruity drink, and then she steamed some rosemary in my glass so that it kind of had that flavor in it when she poured the drink in. The drink was really good. It's not on the menu or anything. She just kind of came up with it on her own. After our drinks, we sat out on the deck and watched the sunset, which is really cool. Not to mention beautiful. So we're just sitting here. Uh, the sun has already set, but it's still kind of light out. We're trying to figure out what we want to do next. I think we'll probably head over to the Heroes Lounge. They don't have a bar on this ship. It's just a lounge area, but we'll go check that out. The lounge is located in the back of the ship uh, across from Guy's Pig and Anchor. And it looks like there's ample seating. And even if there's not room in the lounge, it is kind of open to guys, like I was saying. 
so people could spill over into that scene as well if they needed. It is a few minutes to seven. I'm dropping off my hat and grabbing a cell phone charger, and then we're gonna go check out some shows at Center Stage. Who would have known in the blink of a moment the world turned upside down, trying to go by looking for hope? And I think about what's gone. show and I really enjoyed them. Now we're gonna spend a little bit of time packing and getting ready to get off the ship tomorrow. I'm so bummed. I will show you the progress at some point. We're actually not doing too bad. We've got all the luggage laid out and almost everything packed except for the stuff that's over there and most of that is going in our backpack. So doing good. We are gonna take a break from packing. We gotta run to the casino and cash out our banks. We don't wanna lose out on that money. And then we are gonna go get some dinner at Bonsai Sushi. We've been looking to trying sushi the whole cruise. We did go to Bonsai Tapanyaki on the first night and it was really good. So we were crossing our fingers this was good as well. Similar to the menu at Chibang, you just kind of fill out what you want and then they bring you what you order. I started with some spicy shrimp tempura and Adam had some miso soup. I got a tempura roll and then Adam got a California roll. I also got a chicken skewer and Adam got some fish. For dessert, we both ended up getting this cheesecake in a jar. We are back from dinner and the food was really good. The service Eh, not so much. We got our appetizers and our entrees pretty quickly and then they didn't come clear the table or anything and then for like 25 minutes we were just sitting there like what's going on? So finally we were able to get a hold of somebody, get their attention, and call them over and they said when we asked about our dessert they said that they were out of what we wanted but they never bothered to tell us and it was just kind of a pain in the butt. So they did offer us a different option 
and then they comped one of them which was nice so overall we enjoyed it the sushi was good all the other dishes we got were good too it is almost midnight now and i think i'm going to wrap up this vlog i hope you enjoyed watching what we got up to on our cruise and i'll see you on the next one bye